Hey everyone, Dave with DVE Store. We're here at NAB 2017 at the Sound Devices booth, and Joel is going to talk to us about the new MixPre 3 and MixPre 6. Yes. So this is Joel with Sound Devices, and I'd like to talk you through our new MixPre series. So we've got our MixPre 3 and our MixPre 6. MixPre 3 has three XLR connections, uh, as well as time code via HDMI or linear time code in. Preamps in this sound absolutely fantastic, by the way. Uh, this will capture up to 96K, and it's, uh, we've got a couple different modes. So we basically out of the box ship it in our basic mode. So if you have very limited knowledge on audio recording or you know don't want to learn audio recording, essentially you can plug a microphone in, get levels, you'll get a stereo recording, and it's a very simple operation. We have an incredibly low noise floor on these devices, so if you under record and boost up in post, you're not going to add noise. You're, you're not going to you know, have negative results in post-production. Uh, the more advanced user can switch to advanced mode, and then you get features such as ISO recording and time code via HDMI or linear time code, um, as well as a dual gain stage. Now, just to talk about the preamps a little bit on this, Dave, uh, we have an incredibly wide dynamic range and an incredibly wide frequency response. So it's 10 hertz to 80K. Um, wow. Yeah. Very low noise floor, a negative 130 dBV. So there again, it's a, a lower priced product from us, but it's all discrete class A components in the preamp. They didn't skimp on this at all. Right. It's a die cast aluminum chassis, Gorilla Glass touch screen, and a very intuitive user interface as well. So very, very nice product for us. Then we go over to the six, we add an additional preamp and we have combo connectors. So you can run quarter inch, balanced or unbalanced, line level signals as well as uh, standard XLR. And we also have an assignable stereo return, so you can bring in a camera return, or again, linear time code. Um, so yeah, yeah, very. So are these input switchable between mic and line level on the three, or is it mic level only? They are, they are. They're so mic level only, okay. Mic line switchable, and it operates somewhat like our six series. So you have a PFL for each input channel, gives you all the functions of that particular input. And then again, going back to the touch screen, um, I mean, honestly, you can, you don't necessarily have to read the manual cover to cover to be very effective with this right. device. Okay. Yep. Now these also feature like the USB streaming. You can go That's in correct. and go plug, it's an interface. That's correct. That can go yes. right into yes. DAW. And that is simultaneous with the SD card capture. Okay. So we have a USB connection. Now in this instance, we're using it for power, but you can connect directly to a computer via our Y cable for double, uh, uh, USB-A, uh, or you can connect directly to a USB-C interface on like a newer Mac, for example. Yeah, I was going to say, you have, you have the two USBs on there that you could, Correct. if you are fancy pants, right. you right. can do that. Exactly. So, uh, yep. so on the three, you have the three inputs, so you can run three discrete tracks Correct. plus a mix? Correct. Or, if you really wanted to, it's just a stereo mix. That's exactly right. Okay. That's exactly right. And on right. the six, you have... Four inputs? Four inputs as well as a 3.5 millimeter mini for so, a five and six. So you could do four discrete and a two channel you mix? Could actually do six discrete as well as your two channel mix. So then you can have an up, up to eight record tracks at Correct. that point? Okay. Correct. So you can really rock out that way? You really can, okay. absolutely. Now the Mix Pre 3 will capture up to 96K, the Mix Pre 6 will capture up to 192. Wow, okay. So. Very nice. So powering. You can externally power it via the USB? Yes, yes. Now, and as far as battery power, sorry to cut you off. No, that's right. Um, it ships with what we call our MX4AA, which is a four AA battery sled, which I can take off for you here. And that's actually where your SD card slot is as well. Now, we also have, now that'll give you two to three hours of recording time. Uh, we also have an MX8AA, which will double that, and then an uh, MXL mount, where you can use standard Sony L mount batteries. Okay. And that's two batteries in parallel, so they are hot swappable. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. And that's, uh, is that running like lithium ion? Ideally, yes. Okay. Yep. Okay. Well, excellent. Uh, what kind of, are there any bag solutions right now? Any bag solutions? You know, I don't have a great answer on that yet. There's okay. a lot of our resellers though that specialize in this, so okay. reach out to a reseller that um, like specializes in production. Absolutely, <laughs> it'll be a great solution. Yep, right uh, on. it certainly works well in a bag as well.
Cool. Excellent. Excellent. Well, uh, so this is launching, it should be shipping the beginning of May, correct? On or before May 15th, absolutely. And what's the price point on these? All right, so the Mixpre 3 is $649, and the Mixpre 6 is $899. Excellent. So very good price points. Yes, absolutely. Excellent. Well, we're looking forward to it. We're very proud of All it. All right, well, thank you very Thanks much. Thanks for coming by, Dave. All right, have a good one. Appreciate it, buddy. Do yourself a favor and subscribe right now because when you do, you'll get notified when I upload new videos with lots of cool information. Information that I learned from lots of expensive college and years of experience. Only you get it for free. So, subscribe right now.